royals including Meghan Markle, Kate Middleton and Princess Diana all wore spectacular tiaras on their wedding days. Royal tiaras are often heirloom pieces passed down from generation to generation, and each has its own history attached to it. Some of the British tiaras include emeralds and diamonds worth millions of pounds. How Meghan Markle secretly paid tribute to the Queen on wedding day Camilla Parker Bowles's tiara worth millions more than Princess Diana's British royal dress code rules state only married women can wear tiaras. This means the first time a royal family member put a tiara on her head is on her wedding day. Etiquette expert Grant Harold told the BBC, for married ladies a tiara was traditionally a sign of status and would show you were taken and not looking for a husband. For the gentleman it was a clear sign not to make advances towards the lady in question. Meghan Markle's wedding tiara, the Queen Mary Diamond Bando tiara The Queen Mary Diamond Bando tiara was made in 1932 and was first made for Queen Mary. The tiara has often been seen with a sapphire in the center stone. However, Meghan opted for a diamond as she tied the knot with Prince Harry in May 2018. The tiara was lent to her by the Queen and is formed as a flexible band of 11 sections, pierced with interlaced ovals and paved set with large and small brilliant diamonds. Before Meghan wore it, the tiara had not been worn for 65 years. Zara Tyndall's wedding tiara worth up to £4 million, can you guess whose royal wedding tiara was worth £10 million? Kate Middleton's wedding tiara, the Cartier Halo tiara Kate Middleton wore the Cartier Halo tiara as she walked down the aisle and married Prince William in 2011. The heirloom piece was rather unknown before the Duchess of Cambridge displayed it for millions to see and was first bought in 1937 by King George VI. King George VI gave it to his wife Elizabeth, the Queen Mother, as a gift. The tiara is set with over 1,000 diamonds, 739 brilliant cut diamonds, and 149 baguette diamonds. Princess Diana's wedding tiara, the Spencer tiara The Spencer tiara isn't technically a royal piece, but was worn when Lady Diana married Prince Charles. The tiara belongs to Princess Diana's own family and has been with the Spencers for decades. The tiara was completed in 1930 and was not seen in public for years after Princess Diana died until Princess Diana's niece Celia McCorkwodale wore it for her own wedding in June 2018. Princess Eugenie's wedding tiara, the Greville Kokoschnik Emerald tiara Princess Eugenie wore the Greville Kokoschnik Emerald tiara when she married Jack Brooksbank in October 2018. The headpiece was crafted by Bucharin in the Kokoschnik style popularized in the Russian imperial court and was made for Dame Margaret Greville. The tiara was left for Queen Elizabeth II. The central emerald is a whopping 93.7 carats set in a platinum band with brilliant and rose-cut diamonds.